Hi, my name is Ashish and I'm a podcaster and I've been making podcasts on Anchor for a month. If you haven't heard about Anchor, it's the easiest way to make a podcast. Let me explain. The cool thing about Anchor is it is totally free. There's creation tools that allow you to record and edit your podcast right from your phone or computer. Anchor will distribute your podcast for you so it can be heard on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and many more podcast directories. You can make money from your podcast with no minimum listenership. It's everything you need to make a podcast in one place. So download the Anchor app or go to anchor.fm and make your own podcast. So, what's your podcast? Welcome back to the story of chocolate. But now, we are zooming in into the chapter 3, Adding Sugar. In 1519, a Spanish explorer named Hernan Cortes set out with our army to fight the Aztecs. After many battles, the emperor of the Aztecs, Montezuma, wanted to make peace and in, he invited Cortes to his court. He gave Cortes his first taste of chocolate. Cortes liked the chocolate but he still conquered the Aztecs in 1528. When Cortes sailed home, his sacks were bursting with Aztec treasure, including cocoa beans. Back in Spain, Cortes served the chocolate drink to his friends. They decided it tasted better hot with lots of sugar. It was so good, they kept it to themselves. But the Spanish prince, Philip, Soon he heard about the drink. A group of monks took some visitors from the Central America to meet him. And they brought a tub of chocolate paste as a gift. Prince Philip was hooked. He made sweet hot chocolate and the drink of the Spanish court. Chocolate gossip spread fast. People in Europe were talking about it long before they had even seen a potato. But turning cocoa beans into chocolate paste took a long time and it was very expensive. Only rich Europeans had enough money to buy the drink. They would sit around in cafes sipping hot chocolate and talking about the weather. This was the chapter 3 adding sugar. With lots of yummy and interesting facts about chocolate in the chapter 4. Bye bye!